All right, now you all know the Westminster Dog Show was great, but what about regular dogs, little mutts and yeah. little shelter dogs? That is where the Great Country Mutt Show comes in. Joining us now to talk about it, Richard Schlesinger and John Gunther. Hey, guys, thank you so much for being with us. It's great to be here, and let me compliment you on your outfit. John does not think so. He thinks I look like the good humor man. <laughs> Well, well, that's not it. That was a compliment, right? <laughs> he cool. gave me an ice cream. It <laughs> makes you happy. <laughs> so. I'm getting the last vestiges, is the, that word, of summer. Vestiges. And vestiges. Oh, and nice. happy uh, National Guacamole. Well, well thank you. Thank we appreciate you. That. Thank you. All right, so you're here for a very important reason. Yes, we are. Um, we want to talk about the Mutt Show because it's a big fundraiser for the Little Guild Animal Shelter in West Cornwall. Um, and it is a magnificent event. It's what I call canine chaos it's like hundreds of dogs <laughs> I, it, they don't even have to be mutts i mean to be honest with you there aren't any rules yeah exactly right? yeah they don't have to be mutts we'll we're a taking a look at some them. photos from yeah, last year it, 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 it from was the brainchild year. of this bunny is, williams okay. who's a world-renowned interior designer who supports the, the shelter and we tried it out before the pandemic and it was such a huge hit I mean, even people who didn't like dogs came there, and, I, and they were just so taken by it. It was just the, here, such a fun here, little day. You're looking at scenes from the, from the first one. This, is the, this was my favorite. This is the best lap dog. Oh, my you God. Can barely, you so can barely see that. You have to be over 40 pounds. Yeah, you can barely uh, see the person. <laughs> but I love this little guy with his little glasses on. He's ready. He's going he's for a little here. ride. This gives you a taste of what the, what the scene feels like. It is... People are smiling. The dogs are having a great time, right? There, there are food trucks. There's there's, I, there's, there's ben, and ben and Jerry's. I know it's a competitor to you. Right. But. We'll have to wait and see. <laughs> and it's in beautiful Cornwall. So you get to go out to this beautiful right. section of Connecticut, it's, see all these adorable dogs. It's on the green in, in Cornwall Village. Um, easy to find. Uh, and it's just, a, I mean, it's just a great way to spend, you know, a few hours um, out in the country. Can I just read you some of the... Uh, categories categories yes, of, yes. of absolutely 100%. We don't have many rules, but we have, you know, sort of suggestions. So about here, 100%. Here are the categories: best lap dog over 40 pounds. Over 40. Here's one of my favorite: waggiest tail. Okay, that's a good one. Best mask, best senior, uh, best trick. Parentheses: any trick will do. <laughs> best powder puff. I love this one too. Sweetest pair, the dog that looks most like its owner. <laughs> most <laughs> most unidentifiable mix. We have one of those. Right, we have one. And then we have a parade for the best in show. Which is great. And here is, and I'll be done in a minute, but here is my favorite part of the thing. No dog is a loser here. Yes, everybody every, gets a ribbon. Every dog gets a ribbon. Every dog oh, gets a ribbon. a participation. And if you want to enter your dogs, we encourage you to go to our website, littleguild.org. And, and there's a link there to the website. And pre-register. Um, and, and registration is free. Free. We, we uh, obviously welcome donations the day of the event. Right. Um, but, but even if you don't have dogs, it, it's just a wonderful outing. Do, John, tell us a little bit about the Little Guild because it really is. It's been in there for decades. It's a, it's a, it's a really special organization. It was founded over 60 years ago. And it's grown significantly, but one of the things that makes it special is the individualized care and attention we give to animals while they're in our care so that they become more adoptable and they succeed when they're in homes. And I can tell you, I, I gave up my corporate career earlier this year so that I can walk dogs every morning. Which is And incredible. spend time with them. Like Some Aww. of them have trust issues or if there's training issues. And there are plenty of people like me who do that. Plus we have our staff that includes trainers and things. And it's just, it really is a special place. How many, I got, remember, go ahead, do you go remember ahead. little Luna when you rescued a whole bunch of beautiful Turkish Angora kittens yes. from a hoarding situation? Then I adopted yeah, little Luna. Yeah. 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 Are you adopted from the guild? Yes. Well, she came on. You had a whole bunch of white Turkish Angora cats. Yeah. And one attached herself to my microphone and didn't want to go. So I said, okay, I'll bring her home. <laughs> okay. oh, that old, we that all have true. stories like that. <laughs> but you're, you're adopting out an incredible amount of animals for a year. Oh, yeah. Well, hundreds of animals. And, and, and we're working to get a, a, a bigger new facility um, in the future. Oh, I didn't know so that. Th that, that's in the works. Hopefully Breaking we can news. accomplish it. But, you buried uh, the lead. But it really is a special place. We want to emphasize that this is not this weekend, but next, next weekend, weekend from September 11 25th. To 2. September 25th from 11 to 2. And there'll be music and it's, fun it's just and a, frivolity. It, it's just and a great just, time. It's all going to ensue. So the Great Country Mud Show. Rain or shine? Sept oh, well, let's hope for shine. <laughs> let's hope for shine. It's under a tent. Let's hope for oh, shine. Oh, it is? Okay. <laughs> right on the town green in Cornwall. The, right. Guys, we can't Don't thank you enough Don't forget the website, littleguild.org. Little Say it after me. Littleguild.org. Little Okay, but, and Great, Day, Great Connecticut, Day, Connecticut, littlegill.org. <laughs> Thank you, guys. We appreciate it. Nice Can you give us your 48 hours outro? <laughs> yeah, read <laughs> the prompter. Read the prompter, Richard. Oh, coming up.
we're taking you to a very special salon, oddly enough, for dogs. Yes. Yes. And a little bit later, we're going to talk to some sports icons, the Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. 